What's going on? We back. Good fellow sports TV in the building. Appreciate everybody for checking in. Blessings to all the brothers and sisters out there supporting the channel. Make sure to subscribe button, bell icon button. Won't miss another video. And let's talk about Carmelo Anthony. <clears throat> He's been on waivers for almost a month now, right? And uh, still nobody came knocking at his door. Is it over for Carmelo Anthony? And I believe it may be. I have to see after the All Star break. Um, we remember Rajon, uh, Raja Bell, I think for the 76ers, got picked up in the playoffs. And um, he was playing that at like a CBA league or something like that. And, you know, he made a difference with them making a the run, I think, all the way to the finals versus the Red Lakers that year. So um, it can't be hope if it get um, to the playoffs. I think it can be for Carmelo. But the Lakers had an open roster spot. You know, I still think they got it unless they filled it. Um, you know, Wayne Ellington got picked up by the Pistons, so um, I think it may be over for Carmelo Anthony, man. Um, people say he blackballed out the league, but when you uh, isolation, um, ball dominant player, you ain't LeBron and you ain't Giannis, you ain't in that company, and you start to fade, it's over with, man. You know what I'm saying? He he didn't work in Oklahoma City Thunder, didn't work with the Knicks. Um, you know, kind of got his way out of Denver. You would think like, okay, shouldn't Denver pick him up? You know what I'm saying? They a deep team, but shit, you know, he can, you know, end out in Denver. I mean, what what could he hurt with Denver? He bring, you know, Western Conference experience. He bring a ton of knowledge to a team that don't have that much uh playoff experience. You would think that could be a fit. Um teams like Detroit that's trying to make the playoffs, you think that could be a fit. They only got two starters on their squad that's starting over fifty percent of the league. But it just seems like nobody fucking with Melo, okay? Seem like it's over. Let's turn off the lights. I still release that baby. Um, bang, bang, one more time, whatever the heck <laughs> that song was. It's over with for him. You know, and if, if team, you know, like Portland, you know, ain't checking for him, you know, they need another score. I mean, you look at Charlotte, why they ain't checking for him? And you could say he blackballed out the league, but pretty much when you play the t type of brand of basketball, he play isolation and you stopping the flow. Um, and you, you're not you just you're not willing to fit nowhere. And then the Houston Rockets, you couldn't use you there. Oklahoma City Thunder couldn't use you. You know, teams ain't gonna want you no more. They gonna say his mentality messed up, and they doing exactly what they did to Iverson. Iverson mentality is the reason he got out the league because he didn't wanna he didn't wanna take a, a secondary role. He still thought he was the guy. And Carmelo Anthony, you know, he tried to fit in with the Houston Rockets and and shoot threes and stuff of that nature, but. Pretty much, he just, you know, he just he just ain't the guy. You know what I'm saying? He, I don't know, you know, what else could he do? You know, they, they blamed him for all their downfalls and stuff of that nature. But it just seemed like nobody in the league fucking with Carmelo Anthony no more. You know, it seemed like it's over. Um, you know, he got his wife back. He, he got his wife back. And, um, you know, hopefully he can just move on. You know, if he still want a ball, maybe he go to Israel or something like that. You know, or maybe go over to, to the Euro League or something like that. But, um, like I said, man, I thought the Lakers were going to open up that spot for him. And it just seemed like they don't feel like taking the chance on, on Melo. You know, they ain't feel like nobody want to take a chance. I know teams that can use them. Like I said, Denver. Like I said, Portland. Like I said, definitely Charlotte. You know, Detroit. Them teams that, that, that can use that type of talent, shit, you know, um, the Pacers, they just lost all the depot for the season. Hey, they can use that type of talent. You ain't have to break the bank to pay them, but that's just, I'm telling you, they block, they blackball and mellow out the league into retirement. And, you know, should he, should he accept that? If it ain't over, it ain't over. You know, he still don't think he had a few more years left, but, um, you know, maybe go to your league and hoop out. But if I'm him, you know, you know, I'm gonna fight until I can play. Until I can't play no more. If I can't play, then you know I fade into the black. Start my own businesses. I'm pretty sure um, he paid in the shade, sipping lemonade. But uh, it is what it is, man. Good fellow sports TV. I appreciate everybody for checking in. Make sure you hit the subscribe button, bell icon button. Don't forget me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. You can reach out to the email, DM me on social media. If you've got a business question, inquiry, for your sponsorship. Appreciate everybody for checking in. Blessings to you and yours, man. Keep checking us out, man. We're gonna keep holding it down and putting it down the way we know how to put it down. But, um, you know, you want to make a donation to the channel, that link's always there. Share, share the videos. Definitely blessings to everybody out there supporting our channel, supporting our platform. Keep sharing the videos. And um, like I said before, we on to the next one. Don't forget to check out our NBA 101, the NBA playlist. You won't be mad. We gone.